Welcome to my eco-friendly lifestyle. This way of living was a la mode for a while. Emptying bins of fruit and veg skins to make kitchen waste composts fabulously low cost. And when it all decomposes, I use it all to feed my roses. I grow roses. I grow roses. Spraying on pesticides is not very green besides. I did it once, I have to confide. It's basically poison and a butterfly died. So I'd rather be an organic gardener, even if the leaves get a weird patina. I grow roses. I grow roses. In winter, mulch with well-rotted manure, but careful, sheep dung has quite an astringent odor. Growing, that's my way of life. Just you go and ask my wife. If you practice horticulture every day, your roses start to bloom in May. In summer, don't forget to deadhead and make sure the green fly haven't started to spread. And then sit back with an ice cold beer, smell the roses and watch the clouds in the sky disappear. Watch them grow all in a row. When they flower on my big bush, I get such a mind-blowing head brush. And when they bloom, I bring them into my room and smell their scent every day around noon. The windows used to give a view, but now let just a bit of light through. The roses have reached second story. They're in the overgrown category. I grow roses. I grow roses. I grow roses. I grow roses. I grow roses.